So we're stood here outside the new library building, which is no longer going to open. How does that make you feel? Uh, devastated, actually. I think it's a bit of a, like, it's a colossal waste of money. It's really unfortunate. And, you know, it's another thing that the people of South Nord were promised and the council hasn't delivered on. It's really unfortunate. And or what would it have meant for this area around this building if it had opened? Well, it would have sort of completed the regeneration, you know. We've got the supermarket that's just been done up. They've redone the pavement. They've made the access to the station really nice. The new library would have featured really nicely as a part of that. And, you know, unfortunately, we're not going to get that. We're going to get an empty building that was just a complete waste of public funds and a constant reminder. And if this library doesn't open and the one around the corner closes, what will that mean for South Norway? I think it's quite devastating. Um, I remember going to the library around the corner, you know, during my teenage years and the library would put on events and things like that for the local children. Um, I didn't always have internet access at my home, so it was a really good way for me to do my homework and just complete my studies. Um, yeah, and like it's so beneficial for the community as well, you know, there are mother and baby groups and it's not just a place where people can read books, it's a place to keep teenagers off the street, it's a place for parents to bond with other parents, it's a place for children to learn and appreciate the value of books, yeah, it's, it's more than just a library, it means so many things to so many people and it's like a disaster that it's going to be ripped away from the people of South Norwood. And uh, the councillors, our local councillors, who can help influence the decision, Patsy Cummings and, and Clive Frazier, um, what would your, messages, uh, your message be to Patsy and Clive? Uh, my message would be, guys, listen to us. Like, don't just look at it as a library. Look at it as a community hub. Look at it for its architectural value, the historical value, the way it sort of incorporates itself into the community and don't just think of a library as a place where you can read books. Just think of it as all of those things, you know, it's a community hub and it needs to be saved. It's not, it's not fair that it's taken away for, from the people for no reason whatsoever. It's really unfair. And if you've got the power to stop it and you're in a position to stop it, it's actually your responsibility as our councillors to listen to us and do the right thing.